Hi, this is Aprajita from Avaya Serviceability Engineering team. In this video, we will learn how to reset Postgres user password for Avaya or Experience Portal 6.0 database. We all know that there are multiple Postgres SQL database accounts that can be configured for Experience Portal. But in this exercise, we will be resetting the password for Postgres database account only. We will not do this exercise for report, report writer and VP common users, but the steps will be same to reset the password for any other account as well. Let us begin by logging into Experience Portal Manager's command line access with root login and its password. Now change directory to $avaya underscore home. This is nothing but an environment variable pointing to the parent directory of Experience Portal Manager software installed. So if we do pwd here, this is the location of $avaya home. Now change directory to support slash vp tools slash set db password directory. List here set db password dot sh script is what we are going to use for our exercise here. First of all, let's see what all database accounts are configured for this server. So we'll run a command bash set db password dot sh list. This will list all the database users which are configured for this Postgres database. In our case, we have only one user configured whose name is Postgres. Now we will use the same script to reset the password for Postgres user here. So issue a command on the command line bash set db password dot sh update hyphen u followed by the username which is Postgres in our case hyphen p the password that we want to reset to. So this command will reset the password for user Postgres to Postgres 01. If you look at the output here, it says that update has been successful. But to make the changes effective, it requires a restart for Experience Portal Manager service. So VPMR service has been shut down successfully now. And now it is trying to restart all the components associated with the service. It may take few minutes for EPMS service to come up. Now the output on the screen shows that VPMS start status is also successful, which means the service has been restarted successfully. Now we will confirm the password changes on the system by going to the directory cd slash opt slash tomcat slash tomcat slash lib slash config grep for password in the file voice portal dot properties the output shows us the password that we have reset for postgres user this confirms our changes have been made on the system and hence completes our demonstration thank you for your time today we welcome comments questions and feedback at mentor at avaya.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mintor. For more details or related information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you for choosing Avaya.